make sure I got all of them. Different type of cook-up session today, Mason. We ain't doing a traditional cook-up session. We about to cook up some graphics. Cook up some graphics and some mock-ups. So we in the photo room with it, as y'all can tell. Let me get these white pants out my way first though, bro. I can't afford to let none get on these white pants. So yeah, we in the photo room with it today, y'all. We about to get pictures of everything. Basically what I'm about to do, cause I had done used all my material for these shorts. I bought some white suede uh, used on all the shorts, but I had to use it for a client. So basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna take these shorts right here. Let me show y'all. Take all the shorts. We're gonna take a picture of them and get the blank version of them. And that way I can digitally uh, create the design for it. Well, I already got the design. I just need to actually basically place the logo on it and then you know pick the colors I want and see what else I want to do. So I'm actually kind of glad I'm doing it this way. But we're going to take a picture of each one of these single shorts, crop the background out in Photoshop, and then we're going to put the logo on the shorts like that. And in that way, before I go buy material, I can make sure I got enough material and I can make sure I got the right colors I want to use. So yeah, we're going to take pictures of these and do that. We're going to do the same thing with these white pants. We're going to take a picture of these white sweatpants and then we're going to make uh, the design for those. I just really want to have a pair of these blank first off for once, uh, like a, a blank apparel picture so that I can provide them for my clients and customers that want printing on some white sweatpants. And then also, I just want to do, like I said, I'm going to crop my logo on these because we about to put this drop together. So yeah, man, and we already got these printed on. So I'm going to take pictures of these so that I can add these in the collection that we finna drop and make some mock-ups. And yeah, that's what's going on. We're about to basically make mock-ups. I don't have to make mock-ups of those because that's already done. So. Yeah, cook-up session today, digital cook-up session, basically. But it's also <laughs> a content kind of cook-up session because we getting pictures and video of the stuff, too. So, yeah, that's what we're about to do, man. We're going to go on and get pictures of everything right quick. I'm going to get these pictures with the phone. The camera is dead. I don't know how I forgot to charge the camera, but it's all good. Y'all going to get these with the phone. Get these pics right quick. You need a clean enough picture to... Get these on up to these mine, bro. And I ain't trying to mess them up. I'm about to put these on these. <laughs> Not getting in on these clean white cocaine. Cocaine sweats.
All right, y'all. This is it. It's a wrap. It's a wrap for this portion of the cook-up session anyway. I went on and took like four or five of those, so I ain't got to be trying to double back for them. <laughs> we actually, I can leave these in here because I ain't even got to move them right now. Ain't like I'm about to do nothing. I'm just going to fold these up, leave these in here. Gonna go get the laptop. I hope I charged it up. I think I did. Transfer all these to Photoshop and to the email and computer. And now we can design the actual, you know, cook up. And while I'm cooking up these, hopefully I can think of like two or three t-shirt designs to put in this new release as well. The streets. We could do this nice and easy, or we can go to war. <laughs> what are you doing? Live from the van. Live from the van. Gonna say these right quick, man. Gonna keep this show going. I ain't been in the van in a minute, y'all. So I wanted to come outside and um, work or whatever. I ain't want to work on the inside. So I figured I'd bring the laptop out here. You know what I'm saying? And we'll save all those pictures we just took from the inside. Matter of fact, hold up. Oh, you know what? White joggers front take all the pictures that we just took on the inside and then go ahead delete the background out of them and then put the logo on them so that's what we gonna do right now pretty simple man it's hot out here i ain't gonna cap but it ain't bad as hell the crazy part about it the winter probably gonna hit way better in advance since it be cold and all i gotta do is turn the heat up i actually prefer the fall in the winter over the uh summer for real for real but it's gonna be a fun one, man. It's been a fun year so far. We've been getting the work done. Leveling up every day, as y'all can see, nonstop. And yeah, we in the van with it, live. From the van, man. We're gonna go 10 shorts. Save the last two. Lavender or orchid. Orchid, whatever you want to call it. I be saying orchid. I got to start. <laughs> Can't even talk. Orchid. Mint green shorts. And we good to go. Now, so we got all those saved, y'all. Now I just got to go and open them up and get to it. Matter of fact, I'm going to just highlight all these at one time, bro. So I could do them quick. Boom, boom, boom. Open those up right quick. Hopefully they uh, act right and just knock the background right out and don't trip out on me. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Easy. Easy money, man. That's what I like. <laughs> Nothing like that easy money. So yeah, y'all get the gist of it, man. Like I said, we basically gonna design it like this. I actually done ran and got material now, so I got the material to print them out, but I still rather go ahead and make this design first. That way I can know exactly how I wanna do them and I ain't gotta be guessing as I'm doing the cook up. This ain't gonna really be no freestyle cook up when it comes to the colorway and the design. All right, so yeah, that's that. You know what, right, I know what I'm gonna do. Instead of opening them all as separate files, I'm gonna just place them. So that's what we gonna do. We gonna scroll down right quick. We gonna place these one by one. That way I ain't gotta have all these different files open. And we good, man. Whoa, hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I forgot I gotta do them like this. Forgot, forgot, forgot. You can't do more than one at a time. Rotate them jones. Now, what are we missing? Got the red, we got the tan, we got the, the mint, we got the yellow. We need the orange again. Boom, boom. Let me close out. Oh, you know, I'll leave them joggers open. So now we should be able to knock the background out of all these since that first one did so good. Hopefully it don't trip out on me, man. Oh, snap. It's doing perfect. Hold up. Can't really see, though. <laughs> all right, there we go. Damn, I knew that was going to happen. Okay. Yep, I knew that was going to happen. So I know what I got to do. I knew some of them had a little black in it, bro. So I knew this was going to happen regardless. Got to get a little creative. Get a little creative right quick. Since it want to do me like that. There we go. And it's only because my backdrop is a little wrinkled. And my lighting wasn't that perfect when I took the pictures. And then I did use the... uh 
the iPhone SE, so <laughs> that's probably why, too. The camera ain't just the best camera in the world. But we good, though. We making it happen, and that's all that matter. Boom. There we go. There we go, y'all. Got the orange. We got the yellow. That tan ain't going to give me no problem. Because any only ones going to give me a problem is the ones with the black in it. going to give me a little bit of a problem. So most of the ones that don't got no black in it should be a cakewalk. Boom. 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 That's what I'm talking about. Easy money. I love it. So when doing this, y'all, this is good for like making mock-ups, as y'all can see, making blank uh, apparel files so that you can, if you want to just sell the blanks. Also, it's good for making your mock-up if you want to um, basically, you know, pre-orders and stuff like that. Like I can do this and I don't have to print on none of those shorts until I get a sale or whatever. So, you know, you can play with it a little bit different when you're using the mock-up method and the digital design method versus actually just printing straight on it like I normally do in the cook-up session. So this cook-up session is not a print cook-up session, but I will do part two to this when I actually get to print the short. So this will be a part, a two-part video. Definitely will be a two-part. Bet. So we got all the uh, shorts cropped out. Let me show y'all. Green, I mean mint, orange, tan, uh, lavender, red, cream, and yellow so that's all the short one two three four five six we got seven different pair of shorts so we're gonna start off with the mint because i feel like this one should just be a solid white and we're gonna see how the logo that i just cooked up come out on top of these so first i got to figure out what i even saved the logo is bro because i don't even know like i really don't even know what the hell the logo did i even save it for real for real i never even saved it wow Wow, Reek. Wow. I'm going to go ahead and save this file. So this is the logo that I'm using. We're just going to save it as Creator Gym Shorts right now. Logo. This is the file that I'm about to use. This is the design I'm about to use. But it's going to be two layers. So the inside is going to have white suede. And some of them going to have a base depending on which color I want to go. So this black outline that you see would be the base of it and suede. And then the insert would be layered on top of that. Uh, inside where you see the uh you know the transparent part so basically how this is let me see if i can um okay here we go so like right now let me see something right quick take the stroke off make the color overlay so i can show y'all what i'm talking about so basically if i wanted to put red on top of the uh black that's how it would be and the base would be black but we're gonna go white right now because that's what i'm thinking most of it gonna be but for now that we got that saved, I should be able to come over here and take that logo and put it on here. So now, let's see. Boom, there go the logo, right? And since it's a Photoshop file, I can go to edit it the same way I normally would. And then I can take this off, so look. This is the correct one. Let me go ahead and change this to white. Boom, boom. Stroke, gonna change that stroke back to black for now. And let's see how it look. All right, here we go. So now that's how it would look, right? Cool. So what I'm gonna do is take the stroke off of it for these mint shorts because i think it'll look cool just like that so that seemed cool i wanted to kind of you know cover up most of the shorts the design to be like that and yeah it looked cool like i think it looked cool but now that i see it on here i don't really know how i feel about the design so it looked cool but you know i'm kind of iffy on it so let me try something right quick let's just say if i went with like a if I went with the black, that's how it'll look. Hmm. It ain't a bad design, but now I don't know if I really like it like that for real, for real. So, I don't know, y'all. Let me see it on a different color shorts. Let 
I don't really know how I feel about this no more, y'all. So I gotta, I gotta look at it. I mean, it, it's clean, but I just don't know, y'all. I just don't know. Like, let me try to make a thicker stroke or something. Hold on. See how I look with a thicker stroke. Okay, now that kind of turned it up. I think that looked better. I think that was just too thin of a black outline. Ooh, that's clean. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm I'm run this. I like this. I ain't gonna overthink it. I ain't gonna overthink because the shorts are already dope by themselves. Now what I'm thinking is, since I got the creator right here, should I put a, like an infinity symbol or something like right down here? Or should I just keep them blank, man? That's the real fight right now. But this is definitely dope. I wonder what these look like if I had a blue base. Let's see right quick, y'all. Hold on. Got to do some little testing, man. We got to make sure it's, you know, what we want. Not the color overlay. I meant the stroke. Look, I'm on the wrong one anyway. Wrong one. Let's see how it look on a blue. Hmm. Eh, I feel like the blue doing too much. But that black though, that's clean. So white and black. On the red, the white and black clean. How would it look with just black though? Let me see. It just look too thin. I don't know how I feel about that. So I'm thinking I'm going to run the white with the black, man. That's seeming like the best idea I've had so far when it comes to these. on the At least on the red and black and gold. And then on the orange, white and blue, I'll do that. Not on these because they don't match. So got to get my colors right. So we're going to run the white and black on the orange, white and blue. That's for sure. We're gonna go ahead and um, duplicate that. Let's just merge this already. So that's one down. That's two. Keep it simple on these. So we got the red. And we got the orange shorts ready to go. Orange, we're gonna run the white with the black background. We're gonna run the white with the black brown, black background on the uh red and gold and black. I could have did gold, but I don't really want to do no gold. And they ain't got no gold suede that's that color gold anyway. So two pair of shorts down. Let's see. Yellow, we might well run these next. Now these, I think the blue base would be good. I think the blue, royal blue base on these would be dope. Since it already got yellow. Let's see. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. That's clean. Can't go wrong with that. Yes, sir. And I just feel like it look a little too big on there. But and see, now that I'm doing this, they already made. So basically, I can go in and crop these and put this in my collection of my capsule when I get ready to, uh, you know, cook up. But we lit, though. That's that. I'm going to go ahead and duplicate that. Lock it on in. Get all that little extra background stuff because I can see it. First, I couldn't. Now, 
all the little extra background stuff is up off of there. And we good. So that's the yellow shorts. Boom. Yellow, orange. Boom. Now we good. Time to do these. Now, I don't know what color I'm going to do these for real, for real. I'm thinking I can go. Damn. I don't even know what color. But if I go orange base with white, that might be clean. Because I did grab some orange just in case. So, let's see. All right, now that ain't bad. Yeah, I think I like this. So, we're going to run the cream vine that I got on top of the orange. I like that. That ain't bad at all. Or... Uh, if I got some blue, I might flip it. But for now, we're going to save this and run this. So here we go. Duplicate that one, too. Lock that on in. I ain't going to think too hard on it, bro. Not going to think too hard. I just want to wrap this on up so we can go on and get this drop together. It's time. So we got boom. Got that. We got that. We got that. We got that. Four shorts down. Three more to go. All right. I did the red. What this is. We already got the yellow. What else we missing? Missing the mint. We missing these. Damn, that really go for both of these. But I can do blue on top of these too, though. Hold up. Let's see. 